back to the channel. Welcome back to Mass Effect Legendary Edition. We back in here. We about to talk to the crew. I think we can talk to them one more time before we hit the ILOs. Because we just hijacked the Normandy from the Citadel. We on our run. We're going to get Saren. And we're going to blow his ass the fuck up. So, uh... I can't believe we stole the Normandy. I mean, I'm not surprised after everything you've told me. But still. You scared? You sound worried, Garrus. No, not really. If you're wrong, we'll pay for it. But if you're right and we did nothing, I think we'd regret it a whole lot more. I just hope we can catch Saren before they realize we're missing. We'll catch him. Just be ready when we do. Yes, Commander. Let's go. I wonder what Tally has to say. Stealing an Alliance ship? Risky stuff. It's my ship. But I'm right behind you, Shepard. It's the least I can do. Thanks. Everyone else thinks I'm crazy. Sometimes crazy is the best way to go. It's every Saren. I just hope they don't catch us before we get our hands on Saren. They won't. <laughs> they won't. You. Anything's possible. Let's go. He got his faith in your boy. Shepard. Hold on. Let's go see if Tally has anything to say. I always forget she's all the way in here, away from everybody else, so I forget to talk to her. So I forget to talk to Tally. I mean, uh... Oh, she likes that shit. Don't worry about that. We've got bigger problems at the council, like Saren and the Reapers. Good point. Was there something else you wanted to talk about? No, but her ass is enjoying it. <laughs> Her ass is really enjoying this shit, bro. We just stole the Normandy. We fugitives out here. And she's like, oh, exciting. Fucking dumb, bro. Ah, that's so good. Ash. Commander? She got nothing to say. We'll talk later. Looking forward to it, Skipper. All right, let's go to Ilos. It's time to kill Saren. It was a good run. Whole thing, top to bottom glorious some of the changes i didn't agree with but uh hey it was the vision that they had they wanted to redo me oh yeah let's talk the joker real quick see what he got to say about us still in a normandy because in this game you don't really talk to joker a lot like legit joker has a couple lines in here you talk to joker a lot in mass effect 2 oh damn it no sign of pursuit i was hoping the council would send some ships after us I was looking forward to putting the Normandy through her paces. Figured I'd get to see what this ship can really do. <laughs> Saren's still out there. Maybe we'll get a chance to play hide-and-seek with Sovereign. You know, it doesn't seem like much fun when you say it, Commander. So you need something? How's the Normandy performing? Is she everything they said she'd be? She's the best ship in the fleet. If you've got a pilot who knows how to handle her. Balance isn't what you'd expect. It takes a while to get used to that oversized drive core we got stuffed in the back, and a power can sneak up on you if you're not careful. The Normandy's probably too much ship for your average Alliance pilot, Commander. Lucky for you, I'm anything but average. I have to go. Yeah, you're Joker. All right, see ya. Best pilot in Alliance fleet. Oh, I can't wait to uh, gear start flaming his ass again in Mass Effect uh, 2. That's just funny. Or is it Mass Effect 3? I forget. God damn, I keep pressing the wrong buttons when I go to this map. Because they change it when the next game comes. They make them opposites. Alright, we zoom in out. We're going to Ilos. Refuge. The mass relays. There's whole cities on that planet, like big ass cities on it. You can see them from orbit. And it has three orbits in the sun. We're going in. Skipper. You don't have to call me that. I'm a traitor now. <laughs> I probably shouldn't even be wearing this uniform. We had to do this, Shepard. You know that. 
There's no other way. And you'll always be the skipper to me. Oh, Captain, my Captain. First Alfred Tennyson, now Walt Whitman. You're full of surprises. Dad loved all those sappy poets. Mom was more into Plath. I'm not a word person, Shepard. Other people say what I mean better than I do. We're mutineers, sailing a stolen warship into the most hostile system in the galaxy. I couldn't blame the Council for calling us reckless or aggressive. They can say whatever the hell they want. Everyone on this ship knows the truth. You're assuming anyone on the ship will survive the next week. Optimist. Of course we survive it. Closes all. But something ere the end, some work of noble note may yet be done. Not unbecoming men that strove with gods. We'll get home again, Shepard. I believe you'll lead us through. Oh, Captain, my Captain. <laughs> they followed me to my bunk. <laughs> this is too direct. We're not going like this. All you see when you look at me? No. I see a strong, passionate man with a great ass. Let's go. Been in the gym. You ready to deal with the consequences? I've spent my whole life fighting to get what I want. To get it done, I had to bury a lot of things. During that whole time, not even once did I feel like I was worth what I was fighting for. You make me feel good enough. I can make you feel much more than that. Come here. Let's go. No. I think you're gonna have to come here. Shut up and get over here. Who's she talking to? Me. The real deal demon? Commander Shepard? Come on now, bro. It's too easy out here. Wouldn't it seem like more censored before? I believe it was. I'm not sure. I could be just imagining things, but definitely more detailed this time. Well, now, that's a whole new spin for on the floor and give me 20, huh? <laughs> you still sassing me, soldier? I think you need more physical training. <laughs> Fisk. Now, what will it take to prove I'm in prime condition, Skipper? Bridge to Commander Shepard. We're five minutes out from the Mew Relay. Well, duty calls. Get up to the bridge, Skipper. I've got other weapons to check out. Hey, Shepard. Whatever happens down there, I just wanted to say... Wait. You know what? I'm not telling you. You want to hear this? You'll just have to come back to me. Did they say one, two, or three? What the fuck? <laughs> Alright, that's cool. Oh wow, they made the new relay look like really fucking good. It doesn't look special though. But like around it does, like the whole aura around it. This purple like nebula. Other than that, it looks like a normal relay. Clean jump. Uh, Commander? got company have their sensors picked us up yet well, stealth systems are engaged unless we get close enough for a visual they won't have any idea we're here picking up some strange readings from the planet surface dig us down joker lock in on the coordinates negative on that commander the nearest landing zones two clicks away we'll never make it in time on foot get us something closer wait where the, the fuck is my guy crew members <laughs> is it three Carpets women <laughs> You need at least a hundred meters of open terrain to pull off a drop like that. The most I can find near Saren is twenty. Twenty meters? No way we can make a drop in there. We have to try. Find another landing zone! There is no other landing zone! The descent angle's too steep. It's our only option. It's not an option. It's a suicide run. We don't... I can do it. He can do Joker. it. I can do it. Let's go. Gear up and head down to the Mako. Joker. Drop us right on top of that bastard. Who the fuck are we taking on this? I guess we gotta take Garrus for sure. And I say we take Rex. We take Rex, the real deal hitter. 
Have I, have I leveled him up? <laughs> I don't know if I did. Stealth systems look really fucking good right there. The, the slice shimmer. <clears throat> you two keep moving inside. That drop was hella clean. <laughs> it was so clean, bro. We have to get inside this bunker before Saren finds the conduit. There's no way we're getting past that door with brute force. I mean, we do got... Saren found some way to... We got Rex. There must be some kind of security override somewhere in this conduit. Oh, he's thinking. I thought he was we'll going to brute force We have to find some it. way to get it up and running again. Alright, we're going. Let's go find this thing. Oh, I forgot we got a fight. Wait, before we do that, we need to see where. Yeah. I gotta finish leveling up Rex because it's been a while. Definitely fitness. Definitely barrier because he's a Krogan. Definitely throw. I don't know why the fuck I got warp so high. Maybe because I can get throw. Everybody else is good. Let's get in a battle. Yeah, it's top guild. Gib shooting us? Not Gib shoot. God damn, it's Gib. Oh, there's more enemies. I didn't even notice how it is. Who's over there? We can see them again. Oh, fuck shit. Those are not here before. <laughs> If they were, I do not remember. I'm shredding them, bro. Come on, I was gonna take you a long time to get you with that type of walking. Oh, we should've brought Tally. She would've hacked the fuck out of this thing. Always got to get the loot. Let's go. I mean, all those weapons are actually garbage compared to what we got. We got Spectre status weapons. I forget which side we're supposed to go down first. Oh, wow. Okay, bro. You were just down here just waiting. Oh, some leapers. Some sapper. What the fuck is a sapper? Alright, the real loud hitters with me. Yeah, yeah, I can finish those because I don't feel like working with them. I'm supposed to hack something over here. <coughs> oh shit, I should have brought Tally. Cause we do gotta hack something. Hopefully Garrett's hack skill is high enough. I don't know if he gets as high as Tally's does, but he gets a pretty good uh hacking technique. Are you hiding? I was about Saren and have more Turians with him. The fuck was that? Oh, it's a fucking drone. Get the hell out of here. It's always drones in these games. I mean, there's a clean sweep on the bottom floor. Moving on up. I think they did pretty good re uh, remastering Ilos. The plants, the foliage, the sculptures. The sculptures look really good now. Now you can tell the difference between like the stone they're sitting on and like their body because they all used to be like the same color back then. 
so you could not re you couldn't really tell what it looked like. But these don't even look like proteins now that <laughs> we know what proteins look like. That was the whole bottom floor. Okay. I wonder what race of people these were. I never really looked too deep in it. Cause I was just enjoying the games and the stories that Bioware was telling. I wasn't really trying to figure out everything they fucking wrote about it. I probably should, because sometimes I think about it. Can't you jump this wall? Stop. Thank you. <laughs> Come on, I'm gonna need more than that to kill me. Oh, I'm missing. Hold on, before y'all shoot me, let me loot. This is a big part of the game, and I can't forget it. Ooh, another Turian armor. I wonder if it's good. Hold on, girls. You guys have to change your clothes in mid-battle. Those are all weak. Turian. Nope, it's trash. Okay. We just have to make sure. Who's rushing you? What's up there? Why am I remembering like more arbiters sitting around somewhere and I have to hack them? Oh my gosh, y'all are everywhere. I shot him in the eyeball. Somebody shot me in the back. Somebody help. They're everywhere, bro. Alright, we got that. Am I forgetting something? That armor looks hella fucking good, like Rex's armor. The fucking detail in there, I was not, I did not notice that in the other armor. Oh yeah, I forgot, you can't jump down right there. You have to take the elevator back down. But yeah, the mesh on this freaking armor looks really fucking good. Alright, I think this is the way I was talking about. No, I think this is where I came. Oh, it is. God damn it. Where the fuck am I going, bro? <clears throat> hey, there's an elevator. Yeah, can we take it back up? <sighs> Holy crap. Then we do gotta go around there. for the geth things <clears throat> the walkers
Hmm. Overhead over the courtyard. And here's the elevator. <coughs> what the fuck am I missing? I'm definitely missing something right now. Oh no, this is the right way. We're going down, not up. to shoot everybody that um that stands in our way easy enough paragon chef go renegade <clears throat> yeah y'all really tried to get me didn't y'all oh this is where we have to uh hey can you stop real quick i'm trying to i'm trying to hack these systems hey hey yeah calm down, <laughs> calm down. i want to hack this system real quick And this is before I knew how smart the Geth was, so us being able to, like, hack this thing was crazy. Yeah, let me go ahead and hack this one too, by the way. Yeah, I keep fighting over there. I got it. <laughs> Let's just hack this. And, uh, keep it going. <coughs> yep, keep it going. There's a two more, right? Yeah, because why they in repair mode? I'm gonna just go ahead and take over his brain and uh, do what I want with him. Yep, yep, y'all do y'all thing. Where's the last one? Oh, it's right here. Hopefully, it did not just stand up. I need to hack it first. God, I thought they usually activate. I guess it didn't. Yep, hacked all of them. Now we got a whole patrol squad. Nobody pulling up on us. Right, let me go get this. Open sesame. Yeah, two terminals. There's an up. Oh, yeah, this is where that one box is, isn't it? There's like one crate up here. No, there's no crate up here now. Okay. I swear there was like one box in the middle of that. Could be mistaken. <clears throat> Come on, Saren's already got a head start. We have to go find him before he reaches the conduit. Unless he's already found it. Then we're just walking into a trap. That's a chance we'll have to take. Hold on. Something's happening. Too late. Unable to... Invading fleets. No, no escape. escape. Sounds like some kind of message. But I don't recognize <coughs> the language. It's probably in Prothean. This recording must be 50,000 years old. No wonder we can't understand it. The message is all broken up, but I recognize some of the words. It's a warning against the Reaper invasion. Yeah. Incredible. <clears throat> the cipher must have transferred an understanding of the Prothean language into your mind. Not safe. Seek refuge. Inside the archives. Inside the archives. What's it saying? Can you make out anything <clears throat> useful? Fault Reapers. The Citadel. Overwhelmed. Only oh, hope. hope. of desperation the conduit all is lost it said something about the conduit but it's too degraded to help we should go cannot be stopped cannot be stopped stopped. y'all still good over there yeah y'all still good we're going up to kill Saren now I'm like, I gave me a flag pointing like, hey, go this way. 
<laughs> and you can't see it until you're going the right way already. <clears throat> Crazy mission, bro. But the citizen was definitely gonna be crazy. We're back. Open that door. That could be true. But yeah, it's hella pods. What are all those things on the wall? Some kind of containers? They look like stage <laughs> Did I really just flip the Mako? <clears throat> I really just flipped the fucking Mako. What, <laughs> what the fuck just happened? The Mako can't just flip like this, bro. What? Oh my gosh. This is outrageous, and I can't get out the car. Is there a way to flip this bitch back over? No. This is legit stuck. <laughs> What the fuck? <laughs> I've never seen this happen. I've never seen that happen. Alright. Load auto save. <laughs> Hopefully it's us getting into the fucking... <clears throat> and we're flipped again. Alright, I ran into a bug. <clears throat> there we go. I don't know what the fuck that was. And how did the Mako just flip that easy? It was never able to flip that easy. The steel can barely jump off the ground, but it feels hella light when it flipped like that. It didn't feel like the big tank that it used to be. That still sounds like a good thing. What are all those things on the wall? Some kind of container. They look like stasis bars. Look like stasis bars. Rex, get the finish. I can't see y'all, but I want y'all dead. <coughs> oh, I got him. Easy claps. Mako just too OP. Oh, it's hellos of them. <laughs> I'm glad he missed. I'm not gonna stop though. It's a trap! Saren must have set an ambush. I don't think Saren's behind this. Yeah, Saren ain't got that much control. There's something in the air. There's places? Like, what's a bad place for killing? Like, a, a child's birthday party, maybe? I don't know. We're gonna know. find down there. It has to be useful. It's <clears throat> your hopes up. The only thing we can depend on right now is ourselves. I mean, it is facts. Rick's always spitting facts. You are not Prothean, but you are not machine either. This eventuality was one of many that was anticipated. This is why we sent our warning through the beacons. Looks like some kind of VI program. Pretty badly damaged. I do not sense the taint of indoctrination upon any of you. Unlike the other that passed recently, perhaps there is still hope. 
I mean, it is, Wait but you're wasting time. How come I can understand you? Why aren't you speaking <clears throat> the Prothean language? I have been monitoring your communication since you arrived at this facility. I have translated my output into a format you will comprehend. I mean, you gotta have a lot my of fucking power Vigil. to do this shit. You are safe here for the moment, but that is likely to change. Soon, nowhere will be safe. I don't got time for this. Saren could be at the conduit right now. We have to go. You seek to end a cycle that has continued for millions of years. Hundreds of years. You must first understand it, or you will make the same mistakes we did. The Citadel is the heart of your civilization and the seat of government, as it was with us and as it has been with every civilization that came before us. But the Citadel is a trap. The station is actually an enormous mass relay, one that links to dark space, the empty void beyond the galaxy's horizon. When the Citadel relay is activated, the Reapers will pour through, and all you know will be destroyed. If he turns on the <coughs> Reaper, the Reapers can wipe out the Council and the Citadel fleet in one fell swoop. That was our fate. Our leaders were dead before we even realized we were under attack. The Reapers seized control of the Citadel, and through it, the mass relays. The Reapers are just too smart. Communication and transportation they had everything across planned our empire out were crippled. Each star system was isolated, cut off from the others. Easy prey for the Reaper fleets. Over the next decades, the Reapers systematically obliterated our people. World by world, system by system, they methodically wiped us out. The war was lost. If you had surrendered, they might have let you live. No offer of surrender was ever given. Our enemy had a single goal. The extinction of all advanced organic life. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Through the Citadel, they wanted the them had gone. access to all our records, maps, census data. <clears throat> Information is power and they knew everything about us. Their fleets advanced across every settled region of the galaxy. Some worlds were utterly destroyed. Others were conquered, their populations enslaved. These indoctrinated servants became sleeper agents under Reaper control. Taken in as refugees by other Protheans, they betrayed them to the machines. Mm. Within a few centuries, the Reapers had killed or enslaved every Prothean in the galaxy. They were relentless, brutal, and absolutely thorough. I mean... You said you brought me Yeah, I got cooked. Tell me what I need to do. The conduit is the key. Before the Reapers attacked, we Protheans were on the cusp of unlocking the mysteries behind mass relay technology. Ilos was a top secret facility. Here, researchers worked to create a small scale version of a mass relay. One that linked directly to the Citadel, the hub of the relay network. I want to see the Citadel in mass relay form. It's not a weapon. It's a backdoor onto the Citadel. <clears throat> What happened next? We severed all communication with the outside, and our facility went dark. The personnel retreated underground into these archives. To conserve resources, everyone was put into cryogenic stasis. I was programmed to monitor the facility and wake the staff when the danger had passed. But the genocide of an entire species is a long, slow process. Years passed, decades, centuries. The Reapers persisted, and my energy reserves were dwindling. How did you survive? <clears throat> I began to disable the life support of non-essential personnel. First support staff, then security. One by one, their parts were shut down to conserve energy. Eventually, only the stasis parts of the top scientists remained active. Even these were in danger of failing when the Reapers finally retreated back through the Citadel relay. There were hundreds of stasis pods out They need to make- they need to you show them, them, bro. You killed them? <laughs> it was necessary. You couldn't let everyone die. Better to sacrifice some so others could live. This outcome was not completely unforeseen. My actions were a result of contingency programming entered on my creation. Didn't tell but everybody didn't that. Tell the non essential stuff. <laughs> Facts. I saved key personnel. When the Reapers retreated, the top researchers were still alive. My actions are the only reason any hope remains. 
When the researchers woke, they realized the Prothean species was doomed. There were only a dozen individuals left, far too few to sustain a viable population. Yet they vowed to find some way to stop the Reapers from returning. A way to break the cycle forever. And they knew the Keepers were the key. The Keepers? I still don't understand <coughs> what's going on here. Why is Saren trying to find the Conduit? The Conduit gives him access to the Citadel and the Keepers. The Keepers are controlled by the Citadel. Before each invasion, a signal is sent through the station compelling the Keepers to activate the Citadel relay. After decades of feverish study, the scientists discovered a way to alter this signal. Using the Conduit, they gained access to the Citadel and made the modifications. This time, when Sovereign sent the signal to the Citadel, the Keepers ignored it. The Reapers are trapped in dark space. Mm. Saren can use the conduit to bypass all the Citadel's external defenses. Correct. And once inside, he can transfer control of the station to Sovereign. Sovereign will override the Citadel systems and manually open the relay. And the cycle of extinction will begin again. Not this I'll time. I'll take Sovereign down. Somehow. We going in, There's boys. a data file in my console. Take a copy when you go. When you reach the Citadel's master control unit, upload it to the station. It will corrupt the Citadel's security protocols and give you temporary control of the station. It might give you a chance against Sovereign. Wait, where's the Citadel's master control unit? I've never heard of anything like that. Through the conduit, follow Saren. He will lead you to your destination. Let's go. Saren's got enough of a head start. Grab that data file and let's go. The one you call Saren has not reached the conduit. Not yet. There is still hope if you hurry. All right, Vigil. Let's go. We got two renegade for that. What? Yeah, we just learned a lot. If you didn't know, now you know. The freaking Reapers set everything up perfectly. The Citadel, the mass relays, so many races systems. The Protheans as paragons of civilization. They were fooled by the Reapers, just as we were. They failed. Keep it moving. I've got no intention of ending up like them. Facts. See, a Rex is a real deal demon. He understands, bro. Ain't no way we going out like the Protheans did. They were just a full of just self-absorbed individuals. We ain't going. Pretty I see you. Y'all can't stop me. Ooh, look at that turn. And I got stuck. What am I stuck on? Oh shit. <laughs> I swear the Mako is just a fucking flimsy ass ride now. It is not the big masculine tank it used to be. What is down here? Something big. I never stopped the fight or anything. But something is massive. Oh, it's a fucking colossi. <clears throat> I'm just dodge right past y'all real quick. Thank you. Come again. I ain't got time for it. <laughs> there was not a colossi back then. <clears throat> I don't know why they would put one now. Ain't nobody stopping to fight them. Unless, like, you really want the XP or something. But, like, if you've been playing the game, you don't need it. Go to sleep. And this is kind of further away, isn't it? I mean, my memory is so vague when it comes to like playing through the game again. <clears throat> but I don't remember it taking this long to get to the to get to where Saren is, because you usually do the chase, like you drive down the thing and then it's like there's Saren, and you have to drive and it's like oh you only got 13 seconds. Yeah, this part. Man, the it's incredible. 
We don't have time to admire the view. <coughs> we have to get through that relay. And these geth aren't going to make it easy on us. Yeah, this usually happens quicker, I think. The Reapers were like amazing structures of freaking technology. Getting obliterated. They they high key deserve it, even though thousands of people just <laughs> got obliterated almost instantly. They fucking deserve it. <laughs> they should have listened. <clears throat> Activate the defense and seal the station. Arms aren't moving. Systems not responding. Abandon the Citadel. Evacuate the council. Citadel control. Citadel control. Do you copy? Forty seconds. Hang on, thanks for the good It's all right. We going right through them, bro. We got good shields. Arbiters can't shoot for Colossi. They can't shoot nothing. That mob. Lit though, it looks hella good. Critical failures detected across all monitored systems. Please begin emergency evacuation. So thank you all for watching, like, subscribe if you're new, and I'll see y'all in the next video.